Tom. Hello, everybody. Tom Fox here. Welcome back to more Fire Emblem Echoes. In the last episode, we battled some things that invaded and were dumb, and I don't like. Uh, in this episode, however, we're going to go ahead and explore the Sylvan Shrine, because we unlocked it, so we might as well. Once I'm done with that, we'll move on with, uh, with Celica here to be fighting Blake. Anyway, let's enter! Enter the Sylvan Shrine. You guys awesome. All right. Uh, let me see. I'm just gonna check the order here real quick. Because I can only bring... I think I can only bring ten people in here? No, I can bring more people in there than that. Let me just give Matilda something, though, before we go. Uh, I could have sworn I had a Brave Sword somewhere. Oh, well. Let's give her a Steel... Yeah, Steel Lance. I don't remember if it was on my current character or... Oh, you know what? I think you get the Brave Sword for, um... For Fighting Dean. That's right. I, that's why I, need, I didn't have the Brave Sword before. Okay. I think we're good everywhere else, so let's, let me go ahead and save. And then let's go ahead and explore. Lit my lantern and all that jazz. We are in the Sylvan Shrine. Hey, Just Amar. imagine how many generations these massive ruins have stood witness to. The dusty air carries more than just the scent of broken, rusty iron. It's like I'm breathing in centuries of history. I don't think that and yet, I can see the signs of men of ill intent having come and gone, with no regard for the place at all. Are you done? I feel like he he I, I skipped a bit of that dialogue because he said two and then he like he started another sentence. So I'll have to like I'll have to look back at that. But it sounded like it wasn't like a complete sentence. Breaking stuff, hoping to get marks. I have yet to run to any enemies. This kind of plays like The Legend of Zelda a little bit. Where it's like you have your button to swing your sword and then the L button, uh... Would bring, brings the camera behind you. Let's look for breakable walls as well. We got... Ale? Is that is there something behind here? No. There's a cell door. Uh-oh. Well, I got the bone guy. And more bone guys appeared. That is... Ugh. I don't like bone people. That is of the seven things that I do not like. The heroics are here! Stand aside, bone boy! They're not taking me seriously. Dang! Detach the rear vehicle! Nothing will stop me. Uh... Uh, yeah, attack. Attack. I think even if I crit, it won't, it won't actually do anything. Much. But Claire needs the experience, so why not? And a fire under- a fire in the belly was just the thing to get rid of this guy. Yeah, you're you're going all right, and you leveled up. Who doesn't love a strong man? Can you upgrade yet? No. He's ruined. Uh. Who doesn't love a strong man? Well, being a dude myself, I don't love a strong man. It's like when I played Dream Daddy. I put my turn on as big, strong dad arms because I'm looking for a woman with big, strong dad arms. What? Hey, you got resistance, finally. It's amazing that because you run into so few mages, uh... I guess I'll just recover him. He took a damage. I don't even know from leveling up. He took a damage from leveling up. Technically. Get him in there, I'll get Tobin to follow him. Mmm, don't trifle with him. Were you planning on doing- were you doing a trifle? Don't trifle. I implore you not to trifle. Trifling is something that you do not wish to do. Oh, looky here! Can your friends go abracadabra, let her rip, and then make the sucker disappear? Why don't you get that slack-jawed buggy? That'd be the answer to all midday prayers! You got me bona fide certified! You're a genie for your charge affairs. I got a powerful urge to help you out, so what you wish, I really want to know. 
You got a list that's three miles long, no doubt, so all you gotta do is rub like so, and whoa! Mr. Aladdin. That's a really... I, I like Aladdin a lot. I like a lot of Aladdin. All right. Let me see what I can do for you, Miss Skilk. We'll be able to heal your wounds. Claire, you gonna, you're gonna get a healing, as it were. Way level up! I feel sharp today. Aware. More focused. <laughs> I am. Alright, uh, blah, 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 blah. who else could use experience, 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 who else could use experience? Why, this guy is going to die. Why, this gent here will die. Who could use experience, 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 who could use experience, why, any one of these guys? I think I did only bring the first ten of my units in here, so... I am losing out on some, uh, some, some... MAJOR DAMAGE! Come on. It's a fire burning in the belly. Alright, we still got a guy left. Um, how much health do he have? Eight. Well, hopefully he turns and attacks, uh... Attacks Tobin again, because I want Tobin to get the experience for this. I really want Tobin to get the experience for this. Yes! Oh, just enough to make him level up. Mmm. Delicious. Whoa! I feel light as a feather. You feel stiff as a board? No, wait. That's some kind of hypnosis thing. <laughs> Man, that was too easy. Piece of cake. Bibbidi boo! In the dungeon. Examine. There's a fake wall back here. We got real fake walls! Does it lead to up? Oh, leads to a fountain. Uh resistance. I'm gonna leave that there because there might be another fountain elsewhere that connects with this one. If I drink from that fountain, I will be able to drink from the others. Ah, uh, haha! I knew the prisoners were holding out on me. That's why I let them die in here. This looks like it was a prison at one point and then used for storage at others. And by which I mean, I don't think that I, I'm really hoping that the that the, those bags on the, on the ceiling and the ground aren't bodies, unless this is like a bodily storage unit. I'll I'll check that one later. There we go, we got another, uh, real fake wall here. Which leads to... No, a secret passage. Interesting. Alright, let's go ahead and fight this guy, because there might be something in that room there. Aha! There's only three of them, so this should be pretty easy. Come at me, fools. He says it with such, like, gusto, too, like, Come at me, fools! Say the word and I'm there. Oh, I didn't want him to crit. Who do you think I am? Who do you think you are? Who is this guy? Everything seems so much clearer. Man, definitely picked the right class for him. Can't say the same about a bunch of these other guys, but you know, just 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 saying. Nothing will stop me. Uh, let's move you over here. Why not sagitate this guy? He got beat up a lot. In high school and otherwise. I really want my clerics to be able to level up. Do the I wonder if the, the mages and clerics both end up becoming sages, or if it's just one or the other. He's level 11. I can still have any level 10s. Probably somewhere in my uh Well yeah, I do. Claire. That was the whole reason why I did Sagittae in the first place, so, so I can get Claire to- Woo! Too late. May I? May I? Be gone. I- I do like how she asks permission before killing. Have you ever seen such physical perfection? 
there's a lewd comment to be made there that I'm going to avoid. Stop hogging all the ha! Stand aside! Oh, Forsyth. I'm a vampire! Nosferatu! Oh, she got two attacks. Okay, good. I was almost very disappointed. A stunning victory for a stunning lady. Oh. Still rather immature, though. Uh, Claire and Matilda, even though they have, like, no relation, I don't think they have any support conversations, as far as I've seen, anyway. Uh, I feel like they, they kind of remind me of, uh... Weiss and her sister from, uh, from Ruby. Can I read these scrawlings on the wall here? Examine. Something's written on the wall, but it doesn't seem important. Why? <sighs> Come on. Don't do that. <laughs> Those are gargoyles. I can avoid them for now. There's an, an exit down here. Which leads to a Milla Shrine? Yes, it does. Examine. There's people around here as well. Milla Idol. I find places like this to be intense, almost frightening in an odd way. Usually there's at least something here. There's usually mana herbs here or something. Yep, mana herbs. Fine. Okay. Uh, talk. There is a girl here. Uh, oh, it was so awful. Little girls run off. Uh, Ray? Hey, Om. How goes it? So not to be an old gossip, but I hear you and Celica had a bit of a row. Ladies, am I right? They just love to get the last word in. I thought it was just my mom and my sister who were like that, but nope. When I found out all women share that trait, my poor heart sank. Huh? How can I be so sure it's all women? How can you even ask that? I've been to a town. I've seen, like, a dozen women. Hell, maybe more. Gray. Gray. Clive. After Desai killed the king and the knights were effectively disbanded, it was Matilda who suggested we regroup and start the deliverance. While I wallowed in my stupor and wondered what would become of us, she was the calm voice of wisdom who knew what must be done. I have been pursued by many high-standing women in dresses most fine, but Matilda was the first to truly stand shoulder to shoulder with me. She is a goddess made flesh, and one I scarcely deserve. This guy was the leader of the Deliverance. He's got the lowest self-esteem of anybody I've ever seen. Proceed? Let's see. Is that just more dungeon, or is this... There's, these are fountains. Experience pours forth. What's the other one? The other one's movement speed. HP. Uh, I don't have to take the experience, honestly. I don't know how much experience it is. If it's enough to level up or whatnot. Anybody still level 10? No. Who's got the lowest experience? Claire. Are you sure? She gains... Okay, it's a full level up then. I mean, Claire. Oh yes, I got upgrade her now. Um, Fay or Silk? I think Silk probably needs it more because Fay is Fay's more bulky and is able to take more hits. So I think Silk could use it just to, for the sake of survivability. I feel the light of Mila's blessing. She get the Saint class. Nice. All right, let's do Gray next. Da 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 da. Um, what was that? What is the deal with my women? This to the Sage class. What is the deal with like my female characters and my my male characters? Like it. That's so bizarre to me. My female characters get like the best level ups. But my female characters are like, no, nah, nope. All right, change class. Let's make Claire into a Falcon Knight. Holy cow, she gains a lot of HP! She also gains movement speed and the like. 
wonder if there are different classes you could take from Doom from uh, from Duma idols if we ever get to Regal. Class changed. Eleven HP. She learned banish. Some this is these people are becoming scary. Even he only gains defense, which isn't bad. He could always use more defense, but it'd be nice if he got resistance too, because uh, he doesn't got any of that. I should probably give him a shield or something. Oh, he's got the royal shield already, so that's fine. Class change. Well, here goes nothing. People would say it's a. People said a long time ago that was a waste for me to. Uh, to have Gray be a be a mage, and honestly, I think they're right. All right, the Saint class. Ooh, and she could also use better. She could use Seraphim now. Ooh, and she gets better HP from it as well. Excellent. I wonder how she changes. She still has the cowl. Yep, still has the cowl, but just a bit more of an ornate version of the uh, the cleric robes. I accept my new mission with humble determination. Now she learns Seraphim. She also learns Soothing Light and Absolve. I'll have to take a look at all these abilities to see what they do. Alright, that's everyone I can upgrade for now. Uh, let's go ahead and head... Nope, not examine. Uh, move. Let's go ahead and head back to... Oh, wait a minute. Before I do that... Milla, make offering. Let's give the ale. Gentle Light fills the area. Fatigue has been cured, and the turn wheel has been recharged. To free the captive hearts of one being controlled, you must defeat the captor. Ooh, that's a hint for later on! May you all walk always in the light of Mila's blessing. So, I'm gonna assume that, that has to do with the canter that was in control of that one, uh, that one girl in that one cutscene a while back. So pretty much I have to avoid fighting the girl and and fight the the uh, the mage guy. Those, uh, those gargoyles are there, and there's people walking around as well. So stay away from them. Probably get that resistance found. I'll have to see if it's dried up yet. Can't go anywhere this way. Uh, where was that? Was no, that was something different. Oh, we got another bone bone lord here. Uh, let's go this way. Okay, he can't get in here, but he's gonna be sticking around, so... Alright, resistance. Gray. Gray... It has two resistance, and he's a mage, so I'm giving all of it to Gray. I don't know if I can get around him. Nope! Great. And more bone guys. Wow, look at these guys! Look like a real army here. So we got Seraphim. All right, so what do, what do these abilities do? Soothing Light. So it's five HP to each adjacent. Oh my God, that's really good. And absolve, nullifies damage from terrain. Oh, that's good. She got Banish. Uh, increases attack by 10 when attacking terrors. Nothing will stop me. I'm just gonna throw her headlong into this. <laughs> this is amazing. <laughs> Wow! What a what a time to get that too. Also, and uh, we got it. We don't have a Pegasus anymore. We got an Alicorn. Discipline. Anytime. There we go. Increases all black magic hit rate by ten percent. That's really good. All right. Um. The mother walks with me. Wait. Um and wait. And Forsyth, and wait, and Clive, and attack. Like, these guys are gonna just kind of mindlessly attack right now. I thought he said, like, are you kidding me? Oh, he said, are you, and then the F, I was like, is, is he, what's he saying? Uh, how far can he move? Not that far. All right. Move him over here and talk to Tobin. Tobin, by the mother, did you actually just start a conversation? You were going to approach me anyway. Don't ask me why. I thought treating you like dirt would have inspired you to give me space. Ah, oh, you don't treat me like dirt. Look, you like to vent. I get it. How can you be so nice? I try to be nice, but other people just make me crazy. And when you let me take it out on you, I feel even worse. So what? That's normal. You're my friend. I don't care if you give me guff once in a while. 
Really? Sure. Plus, I'm not so nice. There are lots of things that tick me off. I just choose to let them slide. Except maybe when Ohm or Gray show me up. I can't stand that. Well, they are much better at fighting than you. Hey! <laughs> Sorry, couldn't resist. Oof! Oof! I don't know if we have a mage here that's capable of curing that burn. Let's go ahead and beat him up. Oh, looky here. Oh, looky here. Every time he says that, I think of that Aladdin song. Fine, twist my arm. And then make the sucker disappear. I should probably focus on leveling up Faye so I can get her to sane as well. Such a huge juxtaposition there. Christ! Oh no, don't kill him! Okay, good. Eh! Okay, well that guy's dead. Full shame, full shame. Alright. We're gonna do this cleric style. Bada boom! I'm thinking Seraphim, baby! 4 HP to, to take down, but it's really good against you undead folk. I was sent for a reason. Meanwhile, at Nosferatu Town, where I'm gonna miss. Whoa, would you look at that? I missed! No, 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 no. Bring in the sage! It's hard being this good. Kaboom! Splish. What happened to that little girl? <laughs> Man, that was too easy. Oh wait, was that the daughter of the woman who's Is that what I'm, what I'm thinking of here? All right, uh, there's a secret passage. No, that's not the secret passage. Se secret passage was this way. All right, nope, that's not the secret passage. I was right before, the secret passage was over here. Can I, get, I wish I could get a full view of the map. Also, can I? Oh, I can change the order of people. Oh, but only the people that are currently in here with me. All right, let's run, let's just run through this, this cave. This dank cave. Oh, further down we go, into another loading zone. That's new. Ooh. Examine. Seekers of treasure, come no further unless you possess power. Well, I seek a little girl who apparently is lost, so... And I do have some semblance of power. I'll have to see. If anything else, I'm pretty sure you can retreat from battle in these areas. I don't seek treasure. I merely seek... What the... From where? Oh, in there. Actually, that scared me a little bit. Hot! Hit! Sam! I didn't know we were playing Legend of Zelda. Do all these cells have something? This one doesn't. Are they all gargoyles? Yep, that's a gargoyle as well. I get the feeling if I go to the end here, hey, raw meat. So I get aroused whenever I uh, whenever I do that. Do any of these have fake walls in the back? That one does not. That one... I want to something... Nope, that's just the uh, the lip of the of the, the floor there. This one doesn't have a fake back to it. This one doesn't have a fake back to it, but it doesn't look like there's... Nope, there's nothing in there. Uh, nope. And no, it doesn't look like any of these have fake backs to them, so I'm just gonna keep going forward. I, I won't do any, like, battles that are unnecessary. There is a thing here. You hear a noise behind you. Oh, that figures. Yep. So all I, that I, that I figured that was gonna happen. Just all of them open up. Wow. Is he a anti-flyer? Yes. 
If you draw, take him out! We have two things that are good against against these particular terrors. And by g No, three things actually that are good against these terrors, and by gum, I'm gonna use them. Hit him up! Bip! Bip! Ah, uh, Claire. All right, and for the lady, uh, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so I don't want to put him there. Me, put him over here and wait. Allow me. He can come up, uh, let's see. Yeah, he could fit in there. He can come up there and wait. He can go up there and wait. Oh, I could have attacked with him actually, so that was, that was, that was foolish. Utterly, utterly foolish. Might as well. I can use shove. White magic, physic. Heal her up from from a distance. Thank you. I've got this. Let's have Alm rush in there, and let's have Just Cliff join him. All right, here they all come. Wow, they only do one damage to her. That's actually incredible. Yep, she's using Nosferatu, so nothing, nothing great there, and he's dead. Well, that was underwhelming. Oh boy, magic! Ooh, he's faster. Are they all just going for him? I got so many of them. Might have made a mistake coming here. But, no time to second guess myself now. Alright, we attack this guy. I probably should have actually used something else. Uh, Forsyth, would you be a deer? Thank you. I'm doing it! I'm getting better! My skills improving. Yes. And oh, that's not gonna do anything. Well, I'll do something, just not enough. How much does it even do? Uh, they'll leave him with six. Can I get somebody with at least three attack here? That deals four. So yeah, I gotta attack with with Clive. Das is good. Das is good. Okay, and now here he, he comes, Cliff. I think one of my favorite things about the newer Fire Emblem games is the fact that they're able to seamlessly blend the soundtracks. Not that they can't do it here, it's just that they don't. Like, it goes from the overworld theme to the battle theme. And both are good. Also, excellent crit there. But both are good, it's just... Your training has paid off. In dividends, I assume. Alright, uh, but I, I just liked it better when it was like one track and there was like two different versions of it. Okay, shoot you. A boom Alright, black magic. How much would Nosferatu do? Five. Sagittae would kill it. Then it wouldn't bring it down far enough. Uh, how much would Tobin do to it? Four damage. Let's start with Tobin attacking it. Basically keep it in a corner. <coughs> Scraw! One, two, three, four. Okay. Black magic will go... We'll go thunder. Just, just, just for the extra damage. I know it's a waste of HP, but I just want the extra damage to be on the safe side. 
Okay, let's see, will you hit now? Okay, let's see, will you hit now, son of a gun, you fool. You did not hit at all, you stupid fool, you stupid fool. Oh, no. How's this gonna go? Why did you go and attack somebody stronger than you? All right. Second verse, same as the first. Robin de bobbin de bob bob scabbin de bob de bob bob scab ba da ba da bob. What am I doing? Attack him. Don't crit. The whole point is to level up here. Okay, I'm ready. Nosferatu. Son of a gun. Why won't you die? Ah, screw it. Just finish him already. Gargantuan gargoyles! I think if I hit them, more won't spawn. A stunning victory for a stunning lady. Oh my. Oh my. Now, was that like one enemy or was that. Oh, th okay, that was all of them. Oh, I see. It's a proximity thing. Because there'd only be two there before, but now, okay. I was worried for nothing on that one. Alright, I need to figure out what the deal is with that little girl as well. Writing on the wall. It's not important. <laughs> Screw you. Something about gargoyles and the like. Just want to check these prison cells to make sure there's nothing here that would be... So what did I get for that? Was that just a mark? Did I actually pick that up? I don't know if I actually picked up the mark there. Can I check? I don't know if there was a gold mark there or not. I don't know what I picked up from that. Well, nope. Seekers of Treasure don't come in without strength. I came in with strength, but... I appear to have received no reward for it. Alright, well, I guess we're leaving. I don't know what there was here, or what I was supposed to pick up, but... Seekers of Treasure come no further unless you possess strength. Well, I beat everything in here, so... I might have to come back or something. Well, now it seems weird for an entire load zone to just be for that. Hmm... Right, I'm gonna go back to the area where I first, where, uh, where the Milla place was and see if, uh, the little girl is there. Oh, well, I just managed to sneak by him there. Uh, oh, nope, this is the entrance. Or the exit, I guess. Oh, no! Oh, no! Well... <laughs> Oh, I guess. Just keep attacking, lady. Claire is so bulky at this point that I don't even need to worry about her, like, at all. In fact, Mike's strategy right now? Get everybody out of the attack radius and just let her go to town. God. Like, her only weakness at this point is anti-flyer. Maybe magic a little bit, too, but... She's just so good right now. Don't even sweat. Don't even worry about it. A stunning victory for a stunning lady. Oh, I could skip that without having to worry about. It. All right. Well, they're both dead, so that was the area that was blocked off. Yes. Yes. Hmm. Maybe I did pick up the treasure. I just didn't see it. It was a shield or something or a book. Although, all the stuff is learned naturally. That little girl still isn't here, so I'm assuming she just left. Alright, let's leave then! Getting the heck out of here! More gargoyles. Oh, he's gone. I was hoping he'd be able to sort out my laryngitis. Oh, well. <clears throat> that is a voice that hurts to do. Alright, ups daisy Break all the boxes. Get all the treasure. So I found a little girl who just ran away. I don't know if I'll run into her again. Because I'm really certain that that's that woman's daughter that I was talking about before. 
All right, out we go. All right. So, now that we've explored the Sylvan area there- Oh my god. The Sylvan area there. I'm thinking next time we take command of Celica here and fight ourselves this Blake fellow. I do kind of want to make this guy get into this range here so I could just take them all out in one fell swoop. So let's see. I do this. There we go. Yep, that's going to be it. Anyway, I will see you all next time. Later.